So today the maritime industry is still in crisis and many companies have a huge debt and they're having a hard time to pay their debts and to be healthy. So under the lack of finance, they cannot keep up the quality of their service. We have a huge oversupply of vessels and at the same time slowing growth uh, in trade. Um, and I think this is the biggest challenge for us to, to master in order to survive there economically. I believe that the most uh, important challenge uh, in the uh, maritime industry would be the uh, innovation, uh, communication and the decreasing uh, economic uh, situation uh, in East Asian countries, which uh, maritime industry would be uh, facing with that. We are still using the sh ships designed and everything built 30 years, designed every 30 years back. On a longer term, perhaps, um, trying to improve the image of the maritime industry and, and having, what can I say, a negative footprint is, is definitely not helping the industry in that term. Managing risk and making sure that we have the people in place to manage that risk. It's all about people. Uh, and uh, if you get people trained and operating in a compliant manner, then you take the risk away and you get a good success story. Uh, we need uh, large numbers of people, uh, well-educated seafarers, and where will they be coming uh, from in the future, and how will we be educating them and training them. The key takeaway is actually collaboration, and seeing this very diverse group of, of stakeholders here, ship owners, ship operators, suppliers, uh, banks, and so on, I think one of the key takeaways is really in terms of collaboration. People are willing to share and to, uh, to put their brains together and thoughts together to, uh, uh, to improve the world maritime industry. And of course we need to do this in the context of the global economy. We have the necessary foundations to have a very successful shipping industry. We cannot work in isolation and the best way to actually face all these challenges is if we cooperate, communicate with each other and improve the way that we do businesses. So my key takeaway is to come back again next year. You're asking like billion dollar questions. If somebody knows this answer, will be a billionaire in the, today's market.